going on, you greasy pigeons? Rick Rowley here, Saucy Night Hockey Vlog. Today, I want to chit chat about Ryan Hartman, <laughs> who flips the bird at Evander King tonight. Uh, Minnesota Wild were absolutely thumping the Oilers 5 to 1. And more than likely, you have to assume that Ryan Hartman's probably going to have a meeting with George Peros and the Angel player in safety <laughs> over this situation. Even though Sidney Crosby fucking sucker punched someone the other night and gets jack all. But I don't understand. It's 2022. So you have to think a guy like Hartman knew what he was doing <laughs> in this situation. Like with the amount of cameras like it's a televised event you got eyes around you know people in their phones fucking filming tiktoks and shit like that there's no way that you'd get away with something like this so maybe hartman just gave absolutely zero fucks about the whole situation but to dissect it what had happened was so once again the game's out of hand it's getting a little chippy right five to one uh and then you get kirill capri's fuck who starts getting into it, right? Like mixing it in with Kaylor Yamamoto. Uh, and then Evander Kane sees what's going on. And then he tries hopping in there and, uh, you know, going after Capri's fuck. Now I'll say one thing about Correll, okay? This guy will not back down from anybody. You know, he's a, he's one of them good Russians, eh? You know, fuck, he understands the North American style of hockey. Uh, and then Hartman comes to his defense because, you know, that, let's not kid ourselves. That's what happens in the NHL these days. You know, you got a star player and you always got somebody there, um, you know, that's gonna, that's gonna defend you. But what I'll say about this situation, what I didn't particularly like, is if you watch it, right, you know, Stripes comes in there, right? Like, all the referees, there's all of them there, and they're just trying to fucking break up the whole situation. And quite frankly, as a hockey fan, like, I don't understand that. Number one, we love seeing, you know, the fucking rough stuff, right? But the amount of problems that happens in a game, like the extra crickers, because stripes just don't fucking let the boys go <laughs> right they fucking let them go stripes because that's what ends up happening right like if you don't have the opportunity to kick the shit out of somebody now you got all these you know players that are absolutely fuming and just you know just filled with rage and i don't understand it they've been doing that a lot lately and i it's fucking mind boggling to me. So some people are saying, hey, you know what? Stripes did Hartman a favor. He's probably going to get filled by Evander Kane. And then some people say, hey, whatever. <laughs> we love to see fucking Evander Kane get, uh, you know, the bird flipped on him like that. But one thing I will say is playoff hockey's coming up. And a guy like Ryan Hartman, you want for your fucking hockey team, you know? Stand up for your players like that. He's such a good message uh, for the locker room and uh, the Minnesota Wild. Watch out for them in the playoffs. But let me know what you think, like how many games fucking Hartman gets for that. <laughs> but it was absolutely hilarious. Well done. Uh, let me know in the comment section down below. Hope you guys have a great night. Love you all. Bye.